Let's go over how to write numbers in expanded form. We're going to do these three examples. This is a great way to get a better understanding of how the place value system works. Beginning with 372, you probably know that this seven digit isn't really seven because of where it is in this number. The digit furthest right is two, and that's in what we call the ones place but the seven is one place over to the left, and that's the tens place. So it's not really seven, it's seven tens. Similarly, this three one place value to the left is in the hundreds place. It's representing three hundreds. This is how our place value system works. The first digit, the one furthest to the right, is representing how many ones we have. In this case, it's two copies of one, which is just two. The next place value is the tens place, representing how many tens we have. In this case, it's seven times 10, which is 70. The next place value to the left is the hundreds place. In this case, we have three hundreds, which is 300. This breakdown allows us to write the number in expanded form. 300, we're going in order from the biggest place value to the smallest place value. So it's 300 plus 70, and then plus the smallest place value, which is the ones place. We have two ones. That's how to write the number in expanded form. Go from the largest place value down to the smallest place value and write what each digit represents. Three hundreds, seven tens, two ones. Try our next example, 12,328. In this case, we have the ones place, the tens place, the hundreds place, the thousandths place, and the next place is the ten thousandths place. And here are the labels for that. You can see we have eight ones, which is eight. We have two tens, which is 20. We have three hundreds, which is 300. We have two thousands, which is 2,000. And finally, we have one copy of 10,000. So that's just 10,000. With all this broken down, we can write it in expanded form. I'll color code it after I write it out. Again, beginning with the largest place value, we have 10,000. Then we have 2,000. Again, we're adding it all together. The next place value is 300. Then we have 20. And then we have 8. And that's the number in expanded form. And there it is color-coded. Again, to write a number in expanded form, you just have to write it as a sum of what each digit actually represents. Go in order from the biggest place value to the smallest. Here's one more example for you to try, 654,319. I'll zoom out so you can see the other examples in case that's helpful. All right, hopefully you gave it a try. I'm gonna zoom in and put the answer on screen now. And there it is. This number, of course, goes all the way up to the hundred thousands place. So when we write this out in expanded form, we have 600,000 plus the next place value, 50,000 plus 4,000 plus 300 plus 10 plus 9. And that's how you write a number in expanded form. Once you remember the place values, it's pretty straightforward. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. And thank you very much for watching. Can't even cover myself up from innocence. Where's the love?